Hey guys, the Cube Dude here, and today I have an unboxing from the Cubicle. I didn't realize that the Cubicle put uh, two packages together, so I wasn't expecting this in the other package, which I was not going to make an unboxing for, so uh, I'm not really going to unbox it, but I'm going to take it out of this box. Uh, this is the world's smallest mass produced cube, the Nano Cube. It's a DIY kit. So you put everything together, and it comes with some cool stuff. So it comes with all the pieces, you put the edges and corners together, it comes with two cores, it comes with Maru Lube, uh, all the center caps, and uh, stickers, as well as little tweezers to put it back together, or to put it together. Uh, so anyways, let's get into this. Alright, so something really cool. Here it comes with uh, some things you can cut out. It comes with a cube stand, uh, it comes with a little cube cup. This is the little bag, I guess there's a little bag for the actual cube, which is pretty cool. But here are the stickers, I'll take them out near the end of the video. Alright, so here are all the pieces. I'm going to quickly zoom in on them and maybe bring you guys a little closer into the action. There's two, just in case any of them break. That has happened to me before when I bought the subatomic cube. It's kind of an old video. But anyways, here are the edges. Here's one half of an edge. Alright, so here there are all the edges, all the corners, and all the centers. And let's go ahead and put the center caps on and then go ahead and start so I've assembled the cube, I put two drops of Mario Lube in there, now I'm going to sticker it, but I wanted to show you guys the shades first. So here are all the shades, there's orange, green, white, red, blue, yellow, they look like the standard uh, color scheme. So I'm going to go ahead and put these on and then get back to you guys. Alright, so it's actually been a couple of weeks, I've been pretty busy since I've been home, hanging out with friends and stuff. But anyways, enough of that. Uh, I've since stickered this, I have taken it out in public and cubed with it. I even took it to a bar mitzvah service because I do not like bar mitzvah services because they're boring. And so I just cubed during that whole service and it was a lot of fun. This cube, you can actually do finger tricks on it. Uh, I have pretty big hands and big fingers. So uh, it's a little bit harder, but for those of you with smaller hands, it's definitely doable. And uh, I, corner cutting, I'm not sure if I actually did it in the first half of the video. Just do it here. It's not that great, but just do accurate turning. It's not that hard to like overshoot this if you have this finger here. But uh, anyways, it's a really fun thing to have if you want like non W. If you want WCA stuff and are serious about that stuff, don't get this. But if you want like a cute little thing to add to your collection, I would highly recommend you guys go get this. It's good quality. It turns really nicely. It haven't had any pops. Nothing's broken inside. I've done a bunch of solves on it. Here's what it looks like, fully stickered. I couldn't really get the stickers on perfectly because uh, my hands are pretty big and it's also a little, it's just hard to like get them on because they're so small. But I think I did a pretty decent job. The red one's kind of slanted there. I'm sure you guys could do better though. Anyways, I'll have a link to where you guys can buy this down in the description. I highly recommend you guys go get it if you want some cool little collectible 3x3. One last thing is I really like this little baggie because I can put it on my keys. Uh, this I feel like this might break, but it hasn't yet. But uh, anyways, I might replace it with one of those bigger ones. But I think the baggie is a nice little touch to it. But anyways, thank you very much to thecubicle.us for sending this to me. And I'll have a link to their store in the description as well as, again, where you can buy this on their website. I believe it's $10, and I think it is very worth it if you want some cute little 3x3. Anyways, that's it for this unboxing. If you have any questions, please feel free to let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to like this video if you liked it. This video's letters are PKW. I hope you all enjoyed, and thanks for watching. You call me.